Denmark issued an apostolic decree granting the privilege to consecrate new popes to the bishops of Austria and witness the Aryan controversy in the Eastern Church. Welcome to the Pontiff, a journey into the lives and contributions of the popes of the Catholic Church, brought to you by CNews Live. On 18 January 336 AD, Exactly 18 days after Pope Sylvester's demise, Saint Mark was elected as the 34th Pontiff of the Catholic Church. Though his time on the throne was brief, lasting only 10 months, Pope Mark left a lasting legacy. During his reign, Pope Mark issued an apostolic decree that granted the power to consecrate new popes to the bishops of Austria. This practice has since evolved, with the Dean of Cardinals now taking on this important responsibility. In addition to consecrating new popes, the dean also presides over the conclave that elects them, announcing the new pope's name to the world and presiding over the coronation. Despite his short tenure, Pope Mark faced significant challenges, including the Aryan controversy that raged in the Eastern Church. This heresy had been declared false at the Council of Nicaea, but it continued to cause division and unrest. While there is no record of Pope Mark's direct involvement in these events, his leadership and guidance surely played a role in the Church's response. Pope Mark may have only reigned for a short time, but his impact on the Church endures. His feast is celebrated every year on October 7th, the anniversary of his passing into internal rest on the same day in AD 336. Please subscribe to our channel and like our videos. Till we meet in the next episode, this is Angela Blush signing off for CNews Live.